I'm gonna make lemony salmon with asparagus salad. I'm gonna start by cooking some beautiful salmon fillets and I'm sprinkling on just some prepared lemon pepper seasoning. Okay, can you see Alex? Mm -hmm. So I'm gonna put the salmon down into a, a pretty hot skillet. I wanna sear the salmon. So I've got some oil in there and it's pretty hot. So I'm gonna let it sit there without moving it. I'm gonna go ahead and season the other side with the lemon pepper. And you might notice I have some fried eggs sunny side up over here that I've been oh, yeah. just finishing frying. So I'm gonna let those sit. They're gonna continue to cook really slowly. We will hope that when it comes time to turn the salmon, it won't stick to the pan. Hope and pray. <laughs> <laughs> so the asparagus salad is absolutely amazing. Take a look at this, Alex. What I did was I just took spears of asparagus and a vegetable peeler and just shave them into little ribbons. And I'm gonna make a salad out of this. So some lemon zest and olive oil, not too much, and some lemon. I'll just squeeze it in with just a couple more ingredients. So I've got some feta cheese and look at this up close. This is herbed feta cheese. And that means the feta cheese has herbs in it. <laughs> is that what that means? That's, That's what it means. means. That's what it means. <laughs> some crushed pistachios. So it's just a really amazing, like flavorful, crunchy, nutty salad. And then lots of mint leaves. Did I say the word crunchy? We love the word crunchy in our house. And then I'm gonna grab some salt and pepper as you go across. Don't worry. I need to get rubber bands to tie around my sleeves because I get letters. People worry. <laughs> People worry about my sleeves. <laughs> Okie doke. So look at this, isn't this pretty? I mean, just on its own, I would totally dive into this. Lad Drummond, not so much. I forgot that I have a whole bunch of sliced sugar snap peas, <laughs> so those go in. I kept looking at the salad thinking, why is this salad like so meager? And that's why one of the main ingredients wasn't in. So pretend you didn't see that. <laughs> Okay, and then this goes on the platter. Ah, that's better. That's much, much better. Okay, and then spread it out. All right, how's that look so far? Amazing. Beautiful, right? And then I'm gonna grab a spatula. Got it? Let's see how these look. Let's see if they stick, if they stuck. That one, oh, that one didn't, it looks so good. All right, I'm gonna let the salmon finish cooking. It's gonna take about two to three minutes, and then we will finish off this beautiful dish. And so, here's what we do. I like it when salmon is just barely done. And then even when you take it out of the pan, it kind of keeps cooking, and then it doesn't get too dry, and it's just perfect by the time you get it to the table. Or the island, in this case. All right, third piece and the fourth, and then prepare to be amazed. Ooh, I let these eggs get a little bit crispy around the edges, but I love that. So I just cooked these sunny side up, and how I do that is just put, oh no, <laughs> except for that one. <laughs> oh, shoot, oh man, slippery. We'll just do three fried eggs. Yeah, How does that fine. sound? We're gonna leave that fourth one out because it's gonna mess things up for us. Okay, so this is how, I'm gonna eat this for lunch, but I just put them in a hot skillet with butter and let them kind of set and then I turn the heat to low and I literally just leave them there until the eggs are, the whites are cooked and the yolks are still really runny. So more pistachios go on and then more, mint leaves, which I think is part of the thing that's so beautiful about this. Mm. And then a squeeze of lemon, especially over the salmon. Mm. Mm. This looks great. Oh, I forgot. I thought something, I'm forgetting ingredients left and right. Balsamic glaze. And here's what I like to do. This is truly one of the best ingredients known to man. I'll just do it mostly over the salmon. Just kind of do a little crisscross. Lemony salmon. 
and asparagus salad with three eggs. Make sure you don't do four because that would ruin the dish. 